there is the best player in the world. Anybody arguing? No, I didn't think so. Leading scorer in the Champions League for the third straight season. A third Champions League final for Wayne Rooney. And if you're struggling to remember what he did in his first two, he did a lot of running for others, but both rather passed him by. Wembley looking at its best, Champions League first. A record that will be sorely tested tonight, particularly by this... Mark. Rooney. Carrick. And that is offside. He doesn't usually miss the target, but it wouldn't have mattered on this particular occasion. It's a great spot, you know, for Michael Carrick there. It really is. Watch Hernandez, you can see he's already offside there, but that's... Very top. A mere spectator to these opening exchanges. Long towards Rooney. Mascherano in trouble. Valdez committed. Only just got there in time. I think we've all wondered, Clive, about Javier Mascherano playing as the centre-half. He'll have his hands full tonight against Rooney and Hernandez. They're moving. Villa's flick, though. Messi. In towards David Villa. Ferdinand got Messi. Might come for Alves. Part just reached it. David Villa. Now Chabi. Clipped in towards Pedro. Well, they got in front of Ferdinand. Stole into a goal-scoring position, but couldn't convert. Yep, big chance for Pedro. First little spell in the game when United have looked like they're on the ropes just a little bit. Pedro, as you say, wanders in front of Ferdinand, just steals half. Messi. He's run away from three of them now. Made that four. He slipped it into Pedro. Look how deep Messi comes. And his Parker who's got to get past this time. And he does. Xavi. Abidal is on the way forward. Instead, it's David Villa. He goes for a goal. It's just why. But Barcelona have both of their fullbacks in advanced positions. Villa actually had options right and left if he'd wanted them. He did, Clive, but as soon as he receives the ball, he that. Here he is. On towards Villa. Wrestles with Ferdinand. Play allowed to go on. Lionel Messi. Xavi. Slipped into Villa. It's a good shot. The side just managed to get everything behind it. Two attempts on goal in as many minutes from David Villa. Yep, and all the intricacies of their play with Iniesta and Manchester United might have expected. Petro, more often than not, comes to the right hand side, there on the left. Messi here is from goal. That's where you have to be very switched on and very alive. Particularly when Lionel Messi has the ball. Here's Chavi just trying to. Rooney's pass was loose and Giggs couldn't fasten on to it. And Villa has found Messi. Good tackle by Ferd. About when they have enough possession, not done it enough yet. Xavi slip through, chance for Pedro. Breakthrough for Barcelona. It has been coming. Pedro Rodriguez and Manchester United are going to have to come from behind if they are to win the Champions League tonight. It's too easy. I mean, those passes aren't that quick or that slick. There's just too much room there afforded to top players. And Pedro again, the first touches. Pedro Villa. All accomplished finishes. There they go again. Yeah, see Ryan Giggs there. He's trying to nip in and pinch that off of Busquets. And unless he gets closer, you might as well not bother going. You might... Rooney. Clipped in towards Giggs, who's onside, and Wayne Rooney! Oh, yeah. The best moment yet in the mercurial career of Wayne Rooney! He has never scored a more important goal than that! He may never score a more important goal! 1-1! Absolutely out of nothing. But again, two or three little good passes. We know Barca like to press. Rooney does great here. Oh, that's very, very tight on Ryan Giggs. I think he's just, just on side, but the finish is emphatic. It's a brilliant control finish from Wayne Rooney. When he, when he gets that back, there's always a temptation to drive that off. He laces. He uses the inside of his foot to curl that away from Valdez, giving a goalkeeper absolutely no. Little Messi. Run off it by Valencia. Three. Steps away from Rooney. Lionel Messi finds Chabi. Messi. Made a difference to Manchester United. Here's Iniesta. 
Mastered that. The ball and presented it to Xavi. And now Messi with options left and right. It's Lionel Messi. Slipped in towards Pedro. Xavi plays it into Busquets. Oh, it's such a good idea. Just beyond Pedro. Manchester United didn't see it coming. Uh, just the Barcelona way that they're very rarely going to waste possession by blazing one over the bar from 30 yards. If they can, if they can get enough of the ball. Messi has slipped away from Vidic. Carrick chasing him. Still Lionel Messi. Now David Villa. Now Lionel Messi. And how he failed to connect with that. I'm not altogether sure. Michael Carrick may have had something to do with it. Again, brilliant counter-attacking play from Messi. That ball inside Ever as usual. Then the return, it looks like he's all he's got to do is just find something on the end of that to put that pass band as off. It just, it just had the clearer chances. They led the game for seven minutes. Manchester United showed some resilience. You see the calibre of the Spanish champions. And you see the measure of the challenge. Manchester United, of Messi. Danny Alves is steaming forward to his right. It goes left to ball players. And you look round, you see Ferdinand Vidic standing there. But now look where he is. Yeah, Lionel Messi. So if all they can do is just try and squeeze the space, condense it a little bit, not allow the room. Lovely ball from Iniesta, and Alves has got in behind them. Danny. Messi. Oh, fabulous. Inevitable. The latest in a long, long line of headline goals from the world's greatest footballer. He is a phenomenon. For the 53rd time this season, Lionel Messi scores for Barcelona. At the Bernabeu Club, I witnessed a brilliant goal from Messi where he bobbed and weaved his way past the, the rucker defenders. This time, he doesn't need to. They stand off him and he thinks, I'm going to work the goalkeeper, I'm going to hit it. He does it well enough. I'm not really sure if that sort of shot should be beating Edwin van der Sar. The save he made just now was from close in on Danny Alves. That's, that's a poor one, I think, from his perspective. There was an element of surprise about the shot. Yeah. It's almost as if he caught... Van der Sar unawares and slightly off balance. But as Van der Sar reflects, Lionel Messi celebrates again. The main soloist in the Barcelona ensemble scores another solo goal. And Manchester United must come from behind again. I think you're right. I think the goalkeeper's probably expecting Messi to try and come and take somebody on, draw Vidic. His first goal on English soil. And his 10th match here. Here he goes again. Body checked by Valencia. Got to be careful, Valencia. That's two or three now where he's stepped across the opposition and impeded him. But another European Cup. Iniesta into Messi. And Van der Sar got everything behind that. A little, bit, a little hesitantly, but Vidic was alert. Yep. Good work again from Messi. So it's quality play. These champions. Xavi, in towards Danny Alves, they've cut Manchester United open, Messi, Alves, Messi, both full backs are forward again here, Xavi, it's a good save from Van der Sar, good height, but a uh, good agile dive, whether that's actually coming back in or not, Van der Sar can never be sure on that, he's got to Leap to his right and just get enough on it to steer it wide of the goals. <laughs> Better one two off Carrick. Now he's found Pedro. Hit by Ines. They can get that small spherical thing to him. Fantastic from Messi again and again. Now he made a challenge. Carrick tied his up. Bus gets though. Via! Champion football from Barcelona. Leading international goal scorer scores the most important goal of his club career. And Manchester United need a new cap miracle now. They gave the ball to Barcelona, he'll be furious about that.
but you've got to admire the skill in the finish. Well, you can have the best laid plans, Carl, to try and deal with these guys, but sometimes you just have to hold your hands up and admire Barcelona. Here's Evra, though, turned away by Pique. Ryan Giggs and Wayne Rooney. He goes for a curl up. And that was the roof of the net. Yeah. There's a goal kick. Ryan Giggs could possibly have had that back. He's made a good run, but again, he just stops the ball there, Rooney. And trying to go for something similar to what Viet. Viet. Messi. Oh, it's terrific. Chappie just couldn't. Now Nani. Still Nani. And the shot didn't quite match the run. Yep, decent intent though from Nani, and he does do that very well when he steps inside on his left foot. Doesn't really strike it to give Valdez anything serious to worry about. The cream has come to the top. Barcelona are champions of Europe again. The best of their era, maybe the best of all. Manchester United had two years to try to crack the code, but Barcelona were once again untouchable. Too good, too much for Sir Alec Ferguson's team. Would any team? Pedigree champions again. There are Barcelona hands on the European Cup at Wembley once more. Masters of all they survey.